Hey guys, so starting out I'm using the Benefit Matte Rescue and I'm just going to put that all over my face to keep me from being oily. Then I'm going in with the Porefessional and just putting that in my T-zone where I have larger pores. I'm starting with my eyes today since we are going to be using glitter and I'm just using the lightest shade in the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. Now I'm just taking that lightest brown shade and putting that on the outer corner of my eye and working it into the crease. And I can't really say all of these names, so I'm going to list them down below in the order that I use them. You really just want to lay down some color, blend it out. Lay down some more, blend it out. It's a process, but the longer you take blending, the better it's going to look. Now using that second shade, I'm just going to place that over the first shade that we used just to kind of darken up the crease a little bit. Now I'm using like the darkest brown, I guess I would say, in the palette and just putting that directly into the crease just to darken it up. And this brush is tapered so it's got like a point to it so that it makes it easier to get into my crease. Now going back with that lighter shade, I'm just blending all three of those colors together. Now I'm using the Too Faced uh, Shadow Insurance Glitter Glue and I'm just going to put that all over the lid where we're going to put a glitter because that's going to help it stay longer. And the glitter I'm using is the Urban Decay Moon Dust Shadow in the color Diamond Dog. These are literally the most awesome eyeshadows you'll ever use. And I'm really sorry this clip is blurry and that's literally all I got. <laughs> now I'm just going in with that lightest shade again and to blend any harsh lines where we place the glitter. And just taking a clean blending brush and that shade we laid down for our base color and going back and forth between brushes and colors just to kind of blend it out and make it more smoky and make sure there's no sharp lines or hard edges or anything. Now moving on to foundation. I'm using, I don't even know what I'm using. MAC Studio Fix Fluid and Smashbox Studio Skin mixed together. Okay, I'm so excited for you guys to see this because this is a new product that comes out on February 26th and like you have to come see me and get this. It is the bomb.com times a thousand. It is Do The Hula, which is a liquid version of the Benefit Hula Bronzer. It's matte, and it just gives, like, the most awesome glow. So, instead of using my Anastasia Cream Contour Kit, this is what I'm going to be using from now on. It just gives you the most natural contour, and it's a good base for your powder contour. So, I like it with the... Um, Duo Fiber Blush Brush. I just feel like that applies it the best way. So here I'm just showing Jared. I'm not talking to myself. <laughs> and it actually smells really, really good.
Now I'm just using a concealer. This is the NYX Gotcha Covered, Gotcha Covered, something like that, full coverage concealer. And this is in the shade Light, just to conceal my under eyes and highlight with. Then I'm going to highlight the rest of my face with the NYX HD concealer in the color Porcelain. And I did add a little nose contour with my cream contour kit from Anastasia. So here I'm using High Beam, which is also by Benefit. And it's a liquid highlighter. So it just adds more of like a natural glow to the skin and is a very pretty base for any kind of powder highlighter you put on top of it. Seriously, look at that freaking glow. Like, if you want to strobe to the gods, you need this product. And by the way, no, this is not sponsored. But it can be. Benefit, hit me up. Now I'm just setting my under eyes with the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder. Got me a sample from the Sephora. And I really don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> Now I'm just using the MAC Studio Fix powder to set the rest of my face and this is NC35. Here I'm using Benefit's Hula Bronzer in just the powder version. And I'm going to use the brush that comes with it because it gives you a really sharp contour. And this is very comparable to the NARS Eta brush. So if you don't have that brush and you don't want to spend almost 50 bucks on it, then I recommend getting the Hula Bronzer, of course, because it's the number one best-selling bronzer in the U.S. And the brush comes with it for only $29. The liquid and the powder version of Hoola is like the perfect couple. They're both matte so you don't have any shine so it just looks natural and it is the best product in the world to contour with. Now I'm using the Anastasia Glow Kit in That Glow and I'm using the shade Bubbly, I believe. Yes. And you just want to put that on the high points of your cheeks. Just wherever you put a high beam, you want to put that shade. Now I'm just using that light brown shade again to do the lower lash line. Ah, every freaking time, every time. Yes, ah. I really love that benefit, do the hula. Just gives me the perfect contour bite. Yes. I just love dark and smoky eyes. Then I'm using that darker brown. I actually like the medium. So now I'm just taking that dark brown and going right against the light. I think. I don't really know. I can't see. I'm just going to wipe that brush off onto a towel and then I'm going to go back in with that, that lighter brown and just kind of smoke it out 
a little further down. I'm going to go again with that darker brown again and do that into the crease just because I want it a little darker. A coat of mascara. Or actually a lot of mascara. So I'm using the Benefit Going Solo Lash. So for the, my glue, I'm using the Duo Brush On Adhesive with Vitamins. Grab you some tweezers. I really don't know how easy this is to put on yourself. I like, I really love that Do The Hula. That is really awesome. Like, I look right into the freaking Bahamas, girl. Okay, so... You want to kind of like, you know, do that. And then, like, freak if I know. Okay, maybe my lashes are longer than that. So I probably need to do the long ones. Oh, I don't like this. This is so hard. Okay, that's um not working. Oh, I have a really awesome video idea, but I need to get some else's opinion on it because it honestly may not be awesome. Dose of colors, chocolate wasted. I'm glad I never claimed to be the best at anything. So that's my lip application. 